today is Saturday the 16th of May and we're fishing Perrin Beach. people finally back out fishing again hope all is well this is actually my second trip out um blanked wednesday i popped out to work for a couple of hours down shore and lots of gloopy rot but today i'm using a pulley rig and as you saw earlier tip the girls crabbing so I put a bit into use. See if we can find an early sweet hound. So I'm gonna get that set up and cast out. Just gonna have to bear with me the sound quality guys. My microphone's not working. It's the first pair of all hooked up. Got a bay elastic around it just to make sure it stays on. And I'm just gonna walk over to the end of this coin and cast it straight out. Okay, my second rod, using another big long pulley, big six eye, and for bait, going to be using that very bit of mackerel I used to catch all the crabs on. That's been out of my freezer a couple of times as well, so it's a bit stinky, but it's good enough to go on the hook. So that's what's going on my pulley. So this is the finished product, half a fillet of mackerel there with the tail section still there and that's just going to go straight out here and that's just going to be my bait, I'm just going to leave that all session, if something picks up, it picks up, the other rods I'm just going to keep swapping around with the crabs, um, no bites yet but let's get this other bait out, some cracking colour in the sky tonight just had sunset, can't quite see the sun. But I'm ducking down behind this groin here because it's pretty breezy. No bites yet, but I've only been in the water 15 minutes or so. To be honest, I'm not expecting much, it's a bit early for smooth hounds and a big bait like that. <laughs> well, you know, <laughs> you know, I never expect to catch a big fish, but if I catch something big, that'd be decent. But how have you guys been? How's your lockdown been? Have you, hope you're all well. Hope you haven't got any nasty bugs or anything. But for me, I stopped watching all fishing videos. I haven't really done anything fishing related. I just, I couldn't torture myself like that. And yeah, watching fishing videos would just make me want to get out there. But yeah, this is my second trip out. Went out Wednesday, uh, straight after work. Had a couple of casts, the tide had just turned, and it was literally like casting into a gloopy slime. Um, yeah, no fish either, but I didn't care, I was just so happy to be out. Um, I was going to make a video and had all the clips ready to make one, but it wasn't that exciting to be honest. But I thought, oh, I'll just make one this week, uh, tonight, in our blank. I blank, if I don't, <laughs> there's some fish to watch. But yeah, I'm just holding out for a few hours. Uh, by, well, what's time now? It's by about 8 o'clock now, half past 8. I'll probably fish to about half past 10, 11 o'clock. I think high tide's 8 o'clock, so I'll fish it down for a couple of hours and see if we can find a fish. Just had all these gulls diving down in the water in front of me a second ago. Ooh. I haven't seen them come up or anything, but they're dive bombing a bit. I don't know, just looking for anything really. Still no bites. My phone's done some weird update and all my cameras are not working properly. They all seem quite blurry and not the same quality they were last time. Either that or my phone's gone a bit dodgy. But yeah, no fish yet. I'll probably take my left hand rod in in a minute and do another bait check. 
It's got all goals diving right where my baits are. But can't see anything breaking the water. Some green, extremely weed there. Crabs, a bit covered. But time to stick another one on. No bites yet. The other people are fishing right down there. They've just packed up and gone. It's getting quite dark as well. No evidence of any weed being washed up at all. It seems quite clear in that sense. But it's a nice evening to be out. Just a bit, a bit of a chill in the air still. But I think it's supposed to warm up this week. Mini heat wave, I believe. But hey ho, let's carry on fishing for that fish. Okay, it's now an hour and a half past high tide. I've been stripped. I didn't see any obvious bites. Wind's dropped off now. But let's get this one back loaded up. It's round about now. I expect bites to come on if there's anything about. It's about an hour after high tide. Tide's dropped down. Tiny bit to see the darker patches of the single there where the tide was. I'm just curious if there was any smooth hounds around and because that last one was stripped and that was well and truly elasticated on, so it'll be interesting. Hopefully we can find one. I recently started tracking the satellites, the Starlink satellites. I don't know, I remember at the beginning of the year when I thought I saw a load of UFOs. And uh, I start. well, everyone was saying they were the Starlink satellites. At the time, I hadn't heard anything about them, I didn't have a clue what they were. And just get to seeing all these lights go past the sky and uh yeah i've seen them about four or five times now and yeah pretty similar to what i saw so i'm guessing it was them but they're actually due to go past in about 20 minutes time going from uh west to east so if i can i'll try and film him but last time i struggled to get him to come appear on my camera on my phone but i'll give it a go again in about 20 minutes time Just gave my um, rod tip a quick glow under the UV light. Forgot about um, I painted it. Still works. Painted that beginning of the year now. I've only used it a couple of times in the dark and it seems to do the trick. Actually charges under a normal headlight as well. I turn my um, headlight on. You can hardly tell. Goes white. I mean, I painted the last foot or so. I'll turn my headlight off again. So it saves on the old glow sticks and lights. Nothing to tangle up on the line. But I can uh, might try and get a better mix of the paint because it's a little bit lumpy. But let's see if I can get a stronger mix as well. But it definitely seems to work. Be interesting to see um, if it's been out in the sun for a couple of hours in the summer going into darkness, how long it stays charged for but it's only just a headlight shine over it or a UV torch and it stays charged I don't know if you can see that light in the sky there that's a satellite moving it's not part of the Starlink this one, this is a strobe satellite the others should be coming along in a couple of minutes but hopefully the others should be just as bright as that today. Well guys, no satellites, don't know what's happened there. They're due to come over, didn't spot them at all. You can just about see the wind farm out there flashing away. There's my rod. Still glowing. Faded a bit. But yeah, no fish. Let's switch on my head torch. Wind's completely dropped away, which is really nice. It's quite breezy earlier. But yeah, no fish unfortunately. And I can't see myself staying much longer with no action at all. I'll stay for another 10 minutes or so, and then I'll do a bait check and there's nothing here. I think I'll be calling it a night. Right. 
big bait, that whole mackerel, or half mackerel, should I say, hasn't even been touched, not in crabs. There's a tiny bit of green weed on the rig, so that was about it. But I'm going to take in my left hand rod there with a the crab and see that it's been attacked. So, so when I had the hardback crab on, stripped again. Don't know, maybe it's other crabs. I haven't seen any obvious bites at all. Maybe the weed pulling it off. But there's no way that's climbing off itself. So yeah, not good. Another blank video. I've definitely blanked <laughs> more times than I've caught this year already, which is not good. But saying that, I've only been out probably five, six times. I think I've blanked about four times, caught twice. But yeah, not good at all really, people. Um, got any recommendations where you want me to fish next or what you want me to target? Let me know in the comments below. Um, if you like this video, get a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed already, subscribe. And click that bell sign and you'll get all my notifications every time I upload. And last but least, thanks for watching guys. And I'll see you next time. Bye.